We're here with junior quarterback Tanner Lee. Tanner, your first Big Ten media day is kind of expected to take over the role of quarterback. If, you know, for Tommy Armstrong now that he's departed, uh, have you really soaked it all in that, that you're kind of the face of, of the Nebraska offense? Yeah, I think I've had some time to, uh, you know, you know, realize the opportunity that I've been given. It's been it's been great. You know, it's something I fully want to take advantage of. Uh, it's been a lot of fun, and I'm just really looking forward to getting the season started. We've heard some stories, you know, about off-season workouts, how, how grueling they've been. What have you noticed about them the last couple months? Yeah, they were tough, you know, and, and they should be. And uh, it was a lot of fun. You know, we kind of got into a rhythm of, you know, just putting in the work. And you know, I think it led to a lot of guys stepping up into some leadership positions. And, uh, you know, it really made for a great summer. And it just makes it more exciting to get the season started, yeah. You mentioned the leadership roles that everybody's kind of taken on. And it seems like the, the guys on offense have really just kind of gravitated toward you. Why do you think that is? Yeah, I don't know. I think it's just, um, you know, just kind of focusing on what my job is, and, you know, having a consistent work ethic, you know, I think, and trying to pull guys in and making sure everybody's on the same page like that, and I think that's something guys are looking for, and um, so it's, it's worked out well, but I mean, I think a lot of guys have stepped up in that way, you know, not, not just myself, you know, the guys I'm here with, Chris Weber and Aaron Williams, are doing the same things that, you know, all, all of our leaders are doing, you know, making guys better, and, and teaching and learning and getting in extra work and things like that, so everything that you know, guys should be doing in the summer. We really got uh, really focused on this this time. The past year, you've kind of gotten to learn this offense, Coach Riley and Coach Langsdorf's offense. You know, from the sidelines, what what have you really learned? You know, your season away from the game, uh, away from being out there on the field. Yeah, it was interesting. It was kind of like a like another redshirt year, but it gave me some time to you know learn the playbook and then watch Tommy and Riker run it and uh, just kind of see how this staff works through a season and everything, you know, it was uh, very beneficial for uh, leading into the spring and into this fall camp and, uh, you know, to get healthy and, you know, just to really focus on little things in my game that I wanted to improve and um, developing relationships on the team. So that year was, it was ex extremely important and it's helped me for sure. You mentioned some of those things you wanted to improve on. Where do you feel like you still want to get better between now and game one of the season? Yeah, I just, I just want to be 100% on, you know, the details of, of the playbook, you know, being consistent and completing the ball, and you know, having a high completion percentage and getting first downs and moving the ball. Uh, things that Coach Langsdorf has clearly you know, you know, uh, explained for us, you know, what he expects, and uh, just really looking forward to being that, being that guy. A couple more for you, Tanner. The, the wide receivers, you know, you guys lose a handful of good ones, but also bring back a, a couple decent ones as well. You have Stanley Morgan and, and some guys we haven't seen yet, J.D. Spielman. What can we expect of this wide receiver core, you think? I don't think they're going to miss a beat from last year. You know, Stanley Morgan is, uh, you know, definitely the leader of that group. And, you know, with DeMornay Pearson, knows it's going to be the same guy he's always been. You know, you know a spark plug. He's going to score points and he's going to be a great punt returner. But we got a lot of guys, young guys, looking to step up and that have, uh, have done that this far. And I think the coaches are going to really see that a lot of these guys are going to uh, make plays for us this fall. Now, finally, for you, Tanner. In just over a month, you're going to take the field at Memorial Stadium in front of nearly 90,000 fans. What's that going to be like, do you think? Oh, it, it's going to be great. You know, I think that's the thing I'm looking forward to the most is just finally getting to play in front of our home crowd in Memorial Stadium. You know, you can't beat it. So I'm just really excited. All right, Tanner, thanks for the time. Absolutely. Thank you. All right. Back to you guys in the studio.